Dave, can I ask you something? So the adventure is over, pretty much. All you need to do is you need to take the plane down to, to Moffat, get the final announcement. How satisfied are you with what you've achieved and learned flying electric planes? Uh, well, I'm pleased that uh, what all the engineers said this airplane can do, we exceeded. Uh, so uh, once again, proving the engineers wrong, only this time on the positive side. So that was pretty cool. How does it handle? Uh, kind of like it looks. <laughs> Awkward or? Yeah, yeah it's, it's different. Where do you see the future in electric aviation? Uh, when we have about two more generations of battery density improvement, I think that the uh, flight schools are going to figure it out and start using electric airplanes as the main trainers. You, you, how, how long do you predict that's going to take? About five years, ten years? Um, you know, uh, innovation is hard to predict. Um, in the computer industry, they reinvent themselves every four months. Uh, batteries seem to be a uh, two to three year cycle. So. Um, but again, it's the next big nano invention. Who knows what it's going to be, yeah. right? And then all of a sudden we're off and running. So, okay. Predict. Okay, one more thing. Uh, people have been comparing this year, especially this year's event, as one of the tipping points in aviation, um, similar to, let's say, Lindbergh crossing the Atlantic. But, you know, this is the first year that electric planes have dominated the field, the Green Flag Challenge. Yeah. You, would you agree that this is a tipping point where we're going to see the big turnoff? Turn no. Um, I think that it. It may be, but when you had Lindbergh, that was the front page of every newspaper in the free world, and, and uh, this is not generating that kind of uh, press. There's so many other things going on in the world right now that it's hard to garner those kind of headlines, and I think you need to have the groundswell of, of people behind it. Even in the small world of aviation, this has not made a big splash. You think it should? I wish it would. Um, I think the potential is there that it could, uh, you know, change things quite a bit. But, um, you know, in, in the information age, it's real hard to stay in, in focus of any kind of a headline for more than one news cycle. So it's, um, it's hard to say what's going to happen. Thank you. Really, I appreciate sure. it.